Right on, right on, right. Welcome back to another episode of Cyberpunk. So this episode, I'm gonna do some things very quickly. No one of them is I'm gonna win this boxing match. Hopefully. After that, we're gonna go street racing. Yeah. We'll go street racing. Then after that. We'll uh, take these gorilla arms off because I won't need them anymore. And they can kind of get in the way when I'm trying to throw my knives because, yeah, the game just assumes I want to keep using gorilla arms instead of pull out my next knife. Where am I going? Golly. This is the secret way I took in the last time, ain't it? Can I go up this way? Yes, I can. Probably. Oh, cool. Oh, this ring. Great to see you, V. So, what now? What now, he says. <laughs> the title match. You go up against Razor Hughes. Heard of him, haven't you? I think I've seen posters. He's a pro boxer, right? He is the boxer. You had your head buried in the sand? Never thought I'd see him here. Because, you know, he's a star athlete with elite corpo sponsors. But then his agent tells us it's a good PR move for him. Razor returning to his roots and all that. Prove he's still a kid from the streets. Do I even have a shot? <laughs> a good question. You could be very good. Everybody I fought has been cheated. All optimized by Night City's best bioengineers. I don't know. Maybe Victor will have some tips, tricks. What fix here? What? You think he'd miss an occasion like this? But listen, I'll be honest. Don't look too good for you. But maybe that's better. You know? If Razor's winning anyway, maybe you're looking to earn a little something on it. Cool. Hey, hey! You don't even know what it is yet. Yeah, I can guess. So again, I'll pass. I fight to win. Period. Okay, Jesus, be that way. Vic, what are you doing here? What do you mean? I came to see the fight of the year. Everybody on the street is buzzing about it. <laughs> You're still covered in blood. Down now, you hear? All right, let's do this. So, are you two ready to fight? Only one round. What? One round. All it's gonna take for you to kiss my feet. 
beg for mercy. Right. Where's he at? That's him down there. He got Santa Vista, Mach 1, Karaznikov. He's, he's got some stuff. Apparently, he's an animal. I'm ready. Good. Ladies and gentlemen, night nice citizens, it's time for our heavyweight bout. Facing each other tonight, we have Razor. Are we taking the same stairs? I don't have my own corner stairs? That's trash. Give me some water. Yeah, screw it. We'll probably be fine. Oh, you gonna be my cut? You're my cut man? Hey, hey, how are your spurs before the fight? Good. My knuckles are itching. Now, you won't get far in this sport without confidence. But you know, positive thinking's only gonna get you so far against an opponent like Razor. How do you mean? The guy's a tank. Seriously, nanofiber real skin, shock absorbers. You can knock him on the head with a meat mallet, and he wouldn't even flinch. Appreciate the pep talk. Hold on now, I'm not done. He's got a weakness. Had some abdominal muscles swapped out a week ago, and they haven't taken to him fully just yet. <laughs> oh. You hit him there, it's gonna hurt a lot. Thanks, Vic. Appreciate it. I'll keep it in mind. You two ready? At the gong. Uh-huh! Let's get it! Let's start this thing. May the best roller win! Oh. I did a lot of hitting. Did, did I just let you out my grip? You'd be wise to. Don't think you could take another beating. This ain't over between us. We'll meet again. Tomorrow. Next year. This definitely ain't the last. Yeah, see you around then. I suggest you train in the meantime. Meantime, oh, train time, boy. That's what I'm telling you. You mean backing out? All of them? You fucking shitting me! Alright. Well, I got my money. We are now the champion. They didn't give me the belt though, so I'm kind of sad. Next up. Let's go. Do this. Let's go. Ain't you the goddamn manager? It's your job. I knew this would happen. Only the best could be me. Oh, you. What's up, homie? Hail Cesar. Shouldn't you be putting up a cradle or something? Two days tomorrow. I got time. Yeah, that's what that's what I'm talking about. Hey, if it ain't out yet, you cool. Now that is boxing. Oh, Rhino. Yo, Rhino. I see you're keeping busy. Next time I'm wiping the floor with you, you'll see. 
Alright, good luck. I don't think there's gonna be a next time, but anybody else here? Where are those twins at? Those weirdo twins. Oh these congrats. dudes. Well done. Really? Congrats. Well if it isn't my favorite twins in Night City. What's up, fellas? I'm not, I'm not twins. twins. It's, it's just, just me. me. Anyway, I'm fine. Thank you. Uh, okay. We've talked to... Who else was there? There was that one dude I ended up killing, so he's probably not here. <laughs> and then, uh... Oh, where's the where's the clown at? Where's Ogzo? Did he not show up? Slick work, V. Well, I had a good coach in my corner. All right. Do I get this trophy? I can't even take the trophy. They trash. Let's go. Last time I was here, I had to sneak through this entire building. Now I get to actually just walk out comfortably. It's way better. This way. Uh, I think I screwed up. Hold up. I'm going to figure out how to get out of here. Okay. Now go this way. Okay, so this is what the problem was before. Yeah, getting out of here is a pain, but I'll just go out the way I came in. I hope this is the way out. Shoot. I don't know which the way out. There's a lot of stuff going on. Yeah, this is definitely not the way out. Let's go the other way. You know, something that should be so simple just turns complicated as soon as you try to figure. All right, this way. There we go. They really want smoke, I don't mind. I'm just not really it's not the goal right now. Alright, they want smoke. You know what? That's fine by me. What did you learn? Well, most of you are dead. Somehow I'm still in combat.
install these arms real quick. And also, let's uninstall and reinstall the Sandy because it has not been working at all. Like, I got the pop ones. That's really annoying. Uh, here. Oh. That's fine. Berserk works. Power on Berserk cooldown. Oh, I forgot to un uninstall the gorilla arms. <laughs> Hold up. Wait. Oh, can I not just take them off? Like, are you unable to uninstall stuff? Well, that's annoying. In that case, I think... I 
I go with the Mantis Blades. But I'd rather get the legendary version of those then. As I was saying, strong. Whoopsie. <laughs> uh. Okay. Now everything should make sense. Okay. Seems like it works. the Badlands now. Make sure you're using the right car. So drawing towards me. Okay, so we'll save over this one this time. Hey Claire, next race. You ready? It'll be a tough one. Off-road, lots of lead flying. We'll take Beast. Want to try her out in the field. Nova, FYI, I'm already here. Perfect. Join you in a sec. Sounds good. See ya. No, no, I don't have it. Well, how am I supposed to know who's got it? Dude, this is your problem, not mine. 
Yo, this dude has a coyote, doesn't he? Um, I don't think this is actually a coyote, actually. It might not be. It doesn't have the decal for uh, the company on it. This one looks slightly different. I really thought you'd stand me up again. I thought Bully would have to ride shotgun. This is a coyote. Fantastic shot. He is, yep, he we're is, screwed. But he's talking always. We're driving what? What are we driving? Some bull, some bull stuff? Hey, v. Good to I see you again. Got another race to run. So huh? next time I actually don't Second make four, it. I hope. There's duct tape Ready to go off road? Just saying. It's not a fan friendly event, is it? We want to bake in this sun. Speed, carnage, the crunching metal symphony. Yeah, dull stuff. Think this one will be tough? Badlands, so no fucking around. Anything goes in this race. So you'll have your hands full. You too. What? One mistake and we'll be a four-ton tumbleweed. I can do this. Okay, I'm just gonna melt under that sun, so I'm gonna wait in the car. Sure. This is us, ain't it? Yeah, it's totally us. Ladies and gentlemen, get your pants on right, strap in, and fire up your engine! 30 seconds and counting! You there! Hey! Ignore him. Luigi tries to get in people's heads. You here? Yeah, what's up? Just wanted to wish you luck! Thanks! I didn't realize she was hanging out the side like that. There you go. Just gotta focus a bit. There you go, you need to settle down with that bouncing. All that stupid bouncing is killing us. I guess that's why all the other cars are going slower. To be honest, her car is probably better than my car for this, but I don't think it's by that much. Oh, actually, no, shoot. You want a buck forty, pretty comfortably. I think this is where it tops out too, but at least it has good acceleration to this point. Oh, oh hold on, hold on.
buck sixty-two. That's not a bad top speed. It's faster than, than uh, the Stinger, I think. Oh, this spot. Oh, you're kidding me. I hate, I hate gotcha turns. Like, oop, last turn of the race and it's a big old gotcha. I don't know if I can catch that. We got four checkpoints. Alright, looks like I can. Almost lost that last freaking second. Our winners today, V and Claire! We did it, V! We won! <laughs> Wasn't easy. Drive up to the finish line. corners and slow down the last straightaway, but I'm nitpicking. So, no regrets putting me behind the wheel? Not yet. Your last driver is better than I am? He was. A good husband. Aww. Uh. So you're racing for him. He adored this shit. Had a keen mind for machines. Unmatched. He could talk to him. When he got behind the wheel, it was like he fused with it. But just him. No implants. What do you say we win this for him? I'm counting on you. You want a lift to my garage? Sure, thanks. Let's go. Oh, she's getting the front seat. All right, we have something maybe to talk about this time. Is she actually going to say anything this time, or I'll give her about ten more seconds. She ain't gonna say that. Cool. And then next up, we'll go do. Pyramid song for Judy. Now, if I wasn't mistaken, oh, there's a lot going on there. Oh, I thought there was one here. Well, anyway. 
time. I think 7.30 is early evening enough. Let's go try to holler at her. Yeah. So much trash. Ew. This is not a romantic date territory. be ancient history don't be a gonk any news from the moxes events ideas but no don't see all that much of them how come you know how they are piss me off sometimes is all so what's the latest from clouds know anything nothing of any interest we got a new situation and everybody's trying to adapt. Me too. Doesn't sound like it's all okay. Doesn't mean it isn't. Something got you down all of a sudden? Um, no. Judy. Can we please not talk about clouds, the mocks, or Arasaka and Militech and how the world's going to shit? Just rather not think about any of that today. Anything dark. So... Ready to tell me what we're doing here? Well, I've been tinkering with virtues a lot lately and figured out a way to scroll two actors' experiences at the same time. Okay. Thought we could try it out. If you're down, of course. Sounds like we could do this anywhere. Why do we come all the way out of here? What is this place? Cottage belonged to someone I knew. Since it's empty now, I take the liberty to use it from time to time. And that's where we're gonna scroll? No, we're gonna scroll underwater. Nope, no way. Bad idea. Tell her to find some other yes man. What do you say? You in? Hell yeah, I'm in. Awesome. So, uh, let's go. Got the hardware here. Landlubber. Let's get this scroller on ya. Water's toxic. That not a problem? Whole reason we're suiting up. You haven't even asked me if I know how to swim. Not worried I'll just sink to the bottom like a bag of rocks? 50-50 chance, I guess. Willing to risk it for the footage. It's our first time really getting some Judy cheeks, you know what I mean? We gotta, we gotta savor these cheeks. We don't get to them too yeah, often. Something no fine in that wetsuit. Don't go there, dude. 
<laughs> they need to fix this. They need to fix this game. All right, let's do this. Freezing ass water, here I come. Okay, we're all set. You go first. Stay close behind me and don't descend too fast. Where are we headed exactly? About halfway to the deepest point. It'll be pitch black, but the currents are gentle. Ought to be safe. Want the precise coordinates? Nah, why bother? I'll just stick close to you. Okie dokes. Virtues are more to you than just a way to churn out eddies, huh? Well, duh. Think it. Paintings, songs. They're meant to produce emotion responses. Generally how any kind of creativity works, sure. Right, so art's a casing. Trigger for emotion. Well, BDs are emotion in near pure form. Is that a broken highway? Yup. They literally just damned the area above a highway. see in real time like what I'm looking at mm-hmm and I gotta say it's pretty fucking weird visual sensors are getting stinned right now can't be denied to think I never realized how fit you were I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that great motion calibrated back my way now V next up sound check I'm gonna hum a song. You give me the title. Read me. Hey, I know that. Edda Sorrentino. Only you. Dead on. All right, that ought to do it. What now? Prepare to have your mind blown. Wait for it. Grab this and hold on tight. Down we go. Dam Limited made plans to build a dam. People protested, and the rest is history. Houses, playgrounds, all flooded. Dang. Got some connection to this place, right? You got it. Grew up here. Haven't been back since Laguna Bend was wiped off the map. Why are you showing me this? Want to get the right emotional reactions? Got a feeling this will be perfect for my experiment. Why does this stand to be perfect? 
Hoping you'll be able to pick up all the unfiltered mess of emotions this place brings out in me. Like it or not, you'll react to those feelings. That's what I want to capture. Sounds Nova. Let's do this. Played this moment coming back so many times in my head. Taking me years. Working up the nerve for this. Why didn't you come earlier? Good question. Easy answer would be that I didn't have time. Gear, stars weren't ever aligned. The truth is, the very idea just felt weird. Who installed that thing down there, though? The, uh, the elevator. The water vader, I don't know. The water elevator. Skating rink here? I wish. Played street hockey on rollerblades. Quit schmoozing, Alvarez. We're losing because of you. Tommy! Tommy! You're dead me. What's up with you? Sorry, you gotta go. They're calling. They're calling. They're calling. What about your parents? Dad was never in the picture. Mom died when I was tiny. Can barely remember her. Still have her picture, but you know. Like this fell off your one and only eatery. What was that? Let's see Those now. voices. Voices? Didn't hear anything but you just now. Of course, tasted even better. I don't even know anymore. It's hard to separate actual memories from what you want to remember. Well, our brains weren't built with perfect memory. Uh, not what I was trying to do.
anything in particular here? Nah. Can't hurt to look around, though. Picking up very chill vibes. Feels like we're outside of time. Like, in a snow globe. After that, we can see what lies up ahead. Hard to imagine anything that could be more out of place in an underwater world. Mm. Bottled water? <laughs> Touche, Judy. Touche. Gotta say, I don't really get why they left their wheels behind when they had to evacuate. Or I'm missing. There's something on the ground over there. What, this isn't yours? So it is yours. No. It was Jenny Chapman's. You took her doll. As if. Hit it. It was a monster. You hit it? Why? Because I thought only losers played with dolls. What I really wanted was for her to notice me. Ah, the days when dolls were just kids' toys, and nothing else. Want to see what's further on? Come on, man. Want to show you something. Got no idea how weird it feels, swimming through here. Where you used to run as a kid? Your daily life grinded along? <laughs> Can imagine it a bit. Probably a lot like searching on Titanic. People started doing that and they just saw hallways. Church hasn't aged at all. Always looked old and like it had landed here from outer space. Bells were cracked too. Gave off this eerie atonal clang. Weird. I had no memory of that seconds ago. Now I can almost hear them. I don't know how it's possible. I think I hear those bells too. Seriously? You can hear my memories? It must be a side effect. Ah! Closed. Shame. Could look for another way inside. Be my guest. You like going to this church? Never actually went to church. Never even really paid attention to it. It was just there, you know? Once we knew Laguna Bend was to be flooded, people gathered here to plan a protest. Did it achieve anything? <laughs> Look around.
Oh, here we are. I found an opening. I think we're safe to go through here. On my way. Snuck in here once when no one was around. Stood at the altar and tried to imagine what went through the Padre's mind looking at all those people. Passed out. How'd you manage to lift me out? Dunno, didn't think about it. Just did what I had to do. Hey, careful, easy now. So, you're saying you saved my life. Thank you. Told you diving into this toxic waste was gonna end badly. But you just don't fucking listen. Toxic waste? Is that your construct? You heard him? Uh, heard's overstating. It's just surfaced in my head. A thought that wasn't mine or completely yours. Please just ignore his babbling. It's a complicated relationship. Why do I even bother? I doubt you should go back to the city just now. I'm pretty beat too. Last thing I want to do is drive. Let's stay the night. What do you think? Why the hell... not? Whose cottage is that then? You said you knew the owner. One of our neighbors was hell-bent on staying in Laguna Bend. Badges literally dragged him out of his house before the water came in. So he built himself another house as close as he possibly could, but... Then he got sick. Water was way more toxic back then. Must be chilled to the bone. I'll brew a pot. Hey. How do you take yours? Milk and sugar, please. Going all in, huh? Ah, forgot to start the generator. Generator? What's next? Jacuzzi? Finnish sauna? No, but there is running water. I can turn it on. You're gonna take it easy. Promise to take it slow. Incredible dive. Doesn't get more relaxing than that.
Power's up. Your little spa is open for business. So be careful. Of course I will be. Judy? What was that? Couldn't hear you clearly. Something the matter? No, nothing. Try to. Bullshit me, Judy. We're still synced, remember? Michael's holding all of Clouds at gunpoint. Decides every little thing, apparently. But? No but. Talk to the dolls. They don't see any change. Everything's just like it was before. Got a feeling everything we did was wasted effort. Didn't want to tell you. Didn't want you to think I blame you in any way. Why would you even assume I'd think that? Dunno, I... Uh, I'm sorry. Let's just kill the subject. Think I'll... go... lie down. I'm beat. Oh. Why's she sleeping on the couch? Uh, this chick gets on my nerves. That's you and me below. Just don't wake her up. Judy pisses you off. Why? Because she cares about people? And that reminds you you're a narcissistic asshole? She's all over the place. Refuses to take the door. Jumps out a window. Then acts all surprised when she gets hurt. She reminds you of Alt, doesn't she? Oh, for no, nobody's even close to Alt and what me and her had. Mm -hmm. Let's get the fuck away, can we? You fucking blow if you can. Not about to leave her alone, middle of nowhere. No, I can't talk to you when you get this. Sentimental. Waste of words. At least take a nap so we don't have to argue. All right, Judith, where are you?
Will you sit with me a while? Here's your coffee. Morning. Finally. You know, yesterday, I think I'd made up my mind. I actually called you because I wanted to say goodbye. The city's chewed me up. And they're spitting me out. Night City's not for everyone. I grew up here. Thought nothing could surprise me. And now? I pack up my shit and bail too, if I could. But it's just not the right time. Give me your hand, V. All set, congrats. Just gave you unlimited access to my pad. Whoa, you're asking me to move in? If it's what you want. Or just drop by when the urge grabs you. Don't know what to say. Nobody's ever done anything like this for me. It really shows trust. Take care, V. It's really it. Last time we see each other. Didn't seem so set on leaving just a sec ago. See no reason to delay. I'll stay here a couple days, then head off. It's been nice knowing you, V. See ya. And hit me up on the hollow sometimes. I'll see you, Judy. Hey. I mean, just wait the entire quest line to show some yeeks. It's fine now. That ending was sadder than the other couple endings, honestly. Because we know we can still hang out with, uh, Panem. And then, uh, the other dude's still there, too. River. I haven't finished, um, this storyline yet. Honestly, should. <laughs> 7 p.m. What time is it? Other side of the clock. So let's go with this instead. Well, say bye, Judy. Now we have access to her pad. I think it'll even show up that way as well, right? Like, several of these should. Yeah. River spot shows up. Her spot shows up. The Autocados camp shows up. The old, old Autocados camp doesn't know. And with that, I've been me, you've been awesome, and I hope to catch you on the next one. Please do remember you can leave a like if you've enjoyed this episode, and uh, yeah, continue to bring you some decent content, hopefully. So, peace.